Hi guys, thank you so much for coming back to watch me. If you're new here, hi, welcome. My name is Sol. In today's video, I will be showing you my recent favorites, um, which can also be used as like a gift guide, kind of. Although I am thinking about making a video um, that's purposefully a gift guide, but in case I don't get to it, maybe this can give you some ideas on what to give people or maybe spoil yourself. I know I've been doing that a lot lately. I need to stop because I'm not kidding with whatever I've purchased for myself. I could have probably gotten a few people off of my Christmas list, but that's another story. Um, so yeah, so I just want to get started and um, also say thank you for subscribing. We're almost at a thousand subscribers and I can't thank you enough. It really means a lot to me, so thank you. Um, before we get started, I did want to share that this sweater is from Target in case you're wondering. Um, it is like a knitted kind of like oversized sweater. I ordered it in a size extra small. From Target and then not that long ago I saw that they were actually 10 for self um, for $10 and I was like what I paid full price but so I ended up ordering myself a cream one and I don't know I just like it it's really pretty in case you're wondering and then I am wearing sweats these are from H&M just wanted to be cozy and I don't know I just wanted to give the feeling that you're kind of hanging out with me so like a cozy relaxed laid-back kind of video um, so yeah, so let's get started. So I have a few things in different categories. So I think I'm going to start off with like maybe the smaller stuff. I'm not sure. We'll just reach out and see what we grab. So the first thing um, that I've been loving are the candles. I try to go for like the soy like natural candles, but um, these were on sale at Bath and Body Works a couple months ago actually. Um, and it still has like a quite lift, a bit left. I can't speak today. <laughs> Um, this one's the vanilla bean. I love warm smells. I love vanilla beans. I love um, sweeter smells. And this one is right on my alley. This is the white barn one. And it's a Madagascar vanilla homemade marshmallow and nutmeg. It's very cozy and warm. So that's what I've been burning lately and I really like it. The next item that I've been really liking and I mentioned before are these native deodorants. These are their um, seasonal scents. So this is oat milk latte. This one's sugar cookie. I also have um, a coconut vanilla one, but I wanted to show you the seasonal ones. They smell so good. And I know you're probably like, oh, I don't know if I want to smell like a sugar cookie. No, you want to smell like a sugar cookie. It smells so nice. Given I do like sweeter scents, um, so maybe that's why, but it's not overpowering at all. So that's what I've been loving. Also, if you hear dogs in the background, they're like the neighbor's dog, so there's that. Um, next item that I've been really liking are some socks. These are the Madewell no-show socks, and you know the ones that you wear with like slip-on vans, um, that way your socks doesn't show. But I just love these so much because they're cushioned. They have like the supportive feature in them, and then they're cushioned. They are a little bit pricier, just for one pair it was like $10, but honestly I'd buy more. Um, I bought these in store, so I would have to order them online because we don't have a made wool close to where I live. But I just like them so much, and they're super cute and fun. I just wanted to share. And they're thick, too, so they keep you warm, which is very important now that winter is coming, at least where I live. Um, the next item that I've been really enjoying are these stickers. These are scrapbooking stickers, so they're, like, a little bit different than your regular stickers. They're um, like transparent, so it looks like they're on the page instead of like stuck on the page, if that makes sense. Um, I got, they're from Amazon. I think they're like the old time garden collection. So I have like little, I don't know if it'll focus, but these are little mushrooms. I have little dainty flowers. I've had these for a while, but I've started using them again. These are like some fern leaves. Some like wild berries. I think the last one's a flower too. Yeah, some little dainty flowers. I don't know, I just love them so much. They make journaling so much funner. And I don't know, I just love that it adds a little something to like a plain white page. Just makes it look super um, nicer and gives it like that vintage feel because a lot of these stickers are like vintage colored. Another thing that I've been really enjoying is my Kindle. I've mentioned this before. Um, it's really nice to just have books, a lot of books in one location. That way I don't have to like haul a bunch of books. And I don't know, I also pay for the Kindle Unlimited so you can download as many books as you want. 
that are within the Kindle Unlimited realm and they're free because you're paying for the membership. I think it's like $10 a month, which if you read a lot, I find it to be very um, well, well worth it. And this is just the regular Kindle. I didn't get like the bigger one or the fancy one. And I have a little case and I have a little sticker on it, but I highly recommend that if you have someone on your list that loves to read, I feel like a Kindle would be a great gift. And then staying on the book, topic i did just recently purchase this book and it's become one of my favorites um this one i would have gotten through kindle but they didn't have it um, i would have to purchase it anyway so i found this in store and i'm like you know what it's nice to have a book like actually feel a book every once in a while um and this one is called then she was gone it is like super suspenseful very interesting and it just keeps you guessing on what's gonna happen or why you know I mean the title and she was gone it's about a girl that disappeared and I'm gonna leave it at that but it makes you keep guessing or like make your own inferences as to what happened to her obviously we'll find out at the end I'm assuming I mean I hope um, but I really am enjoying this book it does have great reviews so and I think I saw it um, on like social media like people reading this book I'm like what's that book all about and they happen to have it at Target and it's by the author Lisa Jewell apparently she's really good and just always writes thriller books and this is what it looks like and it also has a cute cover not that you should judge a book by its cover but the fact that it has a cute cover also kind of helps if that makes sense the next item it's also kind of like a book kind of thing um i got this planner and it's like really minimal and cute it looks like this and it goes from july 2021 to june 2022 so i'll be able to use it for a while this was only like eight dollars on amazon but i liked it because it was so unique it's like craft paper instead of regular paper and this is what it looks like so i don't know i just found it interesting and i love the minimal look to it and it also came with little like stickers on the back that you can like put on the pages depending on what um you have on your list of to do's and i don't know i just really like it i'm the kind of person that writes down my to do stuff on a random piece of sticky note or paper and then i just shove them in my bag and then i end up with a bunch of sticky notes and papers in my bag because there's really no way to organize it other than a pe pieces of loose paper so this will go well in my bag and be able to carry it with me and have everything all in one spot and it was very affordable. I'll try to link down below everything that I'm mentioning um, in case you're interested and want to purchase things. Through the links that I do post, I do sometimes get a certain percentage as commission, um, but honestly, it just helps me out a lot. So I would greatly appreciate it if you did use those links down below. And yeah, I just wanted to be honest and transparent to you guys about that. It helps me out a lot because um, whatever, even if it's like a couple cents, I reinvest that back into my channel if that makes sense. So I use that amount to like purchase new things that I want to review and show you guys in case you know, you're interested or looking for a certain item and want to know someone's thoughts on that item. I know I appreciate it when people do like review um, videos. The next item is this little pencil pouch I got from Amazon as well. It's like a tan colored pouch and it is see-through so you can see what's inside and it has like a little zipper at the top like that and then it has a little pocket at the top and I just have my erasable pens and erasable highlighters these are from the brand Frixion F-R-I-X um I-O-N I believe yes and they're from Target you can find them at Target I just love them because they're very functional but they also erase so I find that very useful and then I have this Dr. Grip gel pen got from Amazon as well it's supposed to be very like ergonomic and help with your fingers when you hold a pen and it actually does because it's very like cushiony and um, thicker than most pens so it doesn't like help your doesn't make your hand cramp up after a while if that makes sense as I'm doing a chicken claw <laughs> But I feel like that's what happens sometimes. I'm like holding a pencil and like my hand starts to hurt. But um, that's nice. Next, um, I also have this little American Eagle Sherpa 
crossbody bag. I showed it before I did a little review on my previous video. I really like it. It holds just the right amount of stuff. It's very cozy and warm for winter. And yeah, something I've been enjoying as well, which would make a great Christmas gift. And it was like, I think it was like $30, which was actually not that bad for an American Eagle item. Next, I've been loving this Vitruvi diffuser. I don't have it connected right now because I wanted to pick it up and show you. I love these diffusers so much. Right now, they are having a 30% off sale. All um, items on their website are 30% off. And I just love them so much. I love um, diffusing lavender specifically. And I know they are pricey, but they're well worth the price. And I know there's some like um, dupes out there, but I don't know. I just feel like this is the best one in my opinion. And it has different settings. It has a little light around here and it's ceramics and it's just great quality. Um, this is a terracotta color. I also have the white color and I'm thinking about getting the like deep green color that they have. I think it's seasonal. So I might get it. I don't know. I have this one in the living room, the white one in the bedroom, and then the green one might put in the kitchen and diffuse some citrus in there. But just thought I'd share that. And another thing I've been loving is this Sherpa long coat from Columbia. I love their stuff so much. It is expensive, but it is so worth it. It keeps me super warm and it is lined and i just love it and it's really pretty they have different colors this is a color elk and it has deep pockets and it keeps you super warm i got it in the size small i can still lay your stuff underneath lastly my thing i'm crazy and this kind of contradicts the minimal lifestyle that i try to live i mean if you came over you know that we are pretty more on the minimal side our house isn't that big um we don't have many things we have a lot of plants but anyway i could not hold back on these because i don't know i just find that i had to have one for every outfit even though i didn't but i just liked the colors um and it's these carhartt beanies i have a few <laughs> um they're so warm and super cute and they go with a lot of outfits and let me show you the colors that I have and I'm a bit embarrassed to do this because it's actually insane that I have these many this many but just being honest here and um, tell me I'm not the only one you know asking for a friend um, so the first one I think the first one I ever bought was this one and it's like this um, tan brown color very cute I feel like a lot of people have them you've probably seen them and I matched the bedroom that's funny um take this off because it's actually gonna get really hot then i bought I, I, buy? I don't even know then i think i purchased this pink one this blush one just because this is like my favorite color and i'm obsessed with it got this blush one then i saw this gray one and i was like well i don't have gray and gray goes with anything so i bought the gray one and then i was like oh my gosh this like sagey green color i don't have that color i haven't seen that color it might go away and never come back so i purchased this little mint green color and then this is the one that i have been looking for forever but it's like out of stock online everywhere i couldn't find it and if you go on ebay resellers are like selling them for like triple the price and i'm like why but i ended up finding it at a local store around here and i did order pickup it's this white one i love it so much it's like very super clean and minimal and it is the best it is my favorite out of all of them i think these two are my top favorite just because they go with everything and i thought i was done but actually this last item is my favorite and i've been loving it so far and it is this necklace you've maybe seen it on tiktok that's when my fiance saw it and decided to surprise me with it i had never even heard of these necklaces and take it off to show you maybe you've seen them i don't know but it's the coolest thing ever it is let me see if it'll focus it is this heart necklace and it's from the brand it says something wear felicity and you can get it in gold or silver this one's the gold one because i like to wear gold necklaces necklaces 
and so basically you put whatever picture you want in in the necklace like this little black spot you'll um put it up to the light and like you know close one eye and you'll see a picture in there it's the coolest thing ever you get to pick what picture goes in there and he put um a picture of him and our puppy i don't know i don't know my phone close by but he put a picture of him holding our puppy and it's the cutest thing ever and i was like so happy at first when he gave it to me i thought it was like a gemstone i'm like oh that's cool and he's like no put it up to light and i thought i was gonna say words because i've seen rings that display some sort of like wording or sentence when you put it up to light and it was like our cute little picture and i just love it so much i will cherish it forever and been wearing it ever since and i thought i'd share i don't know that was a super thoughtful gift and that would be a really nice gift to give someone for christmas you know if you have a picture that you know they might love that'd be great and i think it's on sale too i think it's like 50 percent off at the moment for the holidays so I'll link them down below. I just thought it was super thoughtful and super cute and I just wanted to share because I don't know, it's unique. But then again, a lot of people also, <laughs> I've had a few people um, at work, they're like, is that the TikTok necklace? And I'm like, how would you know? I'm like, am I the only one that didn't know? But apparently it's very popular out there in the social media world. Um, I haven't really been much on social media lately. I don't know. I just have so many other things to put my attention towards. But that was a little backstory on my cute little gift and I thought I'd share. And with that, I think that concludes the video. Um, thank you so much for watching. If you liked it, go ahead, and, go ahead and give it a thumbs up. It lets me know that you like this kind of content. And leave me your comments and suggestions down below. I love reading them. In fact, a couple people have suggested for me to do like a hair care routine video or just talk about what products I use in my hair because apparently, I, apparently it looks interesting. <laughs> um, I know it's very long, I need to cut it, but I'm thinking I'll do a video on that next to show you guys the products. I hope you guys are not disappointed because I use a lot of like drugstore products, which I think might be helpful for a lot of you if you're on a budget. And yeah, I'll stop rambling on. And thank you, I'll see you in the next video.